they're at it again. Gun ban coming to a state near you. Hate to say it, but on Friday, a fellow YouTuber who I'm going to give credit and I want you to go subscribe to his channel. He's on top of this stuff. I'm not, but he has to get the word out. I'm going to get the word out. Don't have a big following here, but if I get one person, a dozen, the more the merrier, right? But if I only help one person be prepared and know what's going on, maybe he'll tell one person. Maybe they'll tell one. Not happy about it. Happened Friday. But basically, um, then let me pull it up here for you. The uh, House Representative, David, and I'm not even going to try to pronounce his last name. I've come up with my own little nickname, Sick Eileen. He introduced, uh, and I say that, I try to stay positive, but uh, he's not making any friends here, and I think he's going to make the situation worse. I know they're trying to do something, trying to protect the people, try to stop these incidents from happening. It's not the gun that's the problem, and they haven't realized that. Um, even if they could take them, this type of gun away, which they're calling assault weapon, uh, it's just going to be a different tool. I Anyway... Hence, David Sick Eileen introduced H.R. 1808. And if you're like me, I understand a bill and how it's proposed before the House and Congress and all that in the Senate. But I, I like 1808, what is that? So, uh, you know, first of all, I went off and looked at the bill. And that, again, gives credit to another YouTuber who I'm going to give credit here in a minute. And the bill you know, shows 1808 that David had introduced it. And if we go to the bill, it, it starts off with a bill. Yay. And up above it has all the, you know, the preamble, I'll call it. And here, this is what's going to happen, the definitions. What they're going to do, in general, 921 States Code is amended by inserting paragraph after paragraph 29, the term semi-automatic pistol remaining, blah, blah, blah. We'll go into this in a little bit. So I said, what is Title 18? Let me look that up. Well, if you go back, it's basically the law of the land. It, it, it provides all the definitions and terms and uh, you know everything from schools and courthouses to firearms. And, and this is what 921 is, uh, is firearms. And in that firearm section, in paragraph 29, that's what these are, paragraphs, after this, they're going to insert this part of the bill after paragraph 29, so right here, after this, they are going to insert this right here, the term semi-automatic pistol. So if you're not you know, they're going to talk about semiotic rifle. They're going to define, basically, what they're, they are calling a, you know, mass weapon of war and, you know, all the, but it's an assault rifle. So you, you can see it. They go into the a grenade launcher, a barrel shroud, a threaded barrel. Um, they go into pistol grips. Um, they go into the manufacturing um, we get into some of this stuff here, like right here, manu if it has a manufactured weight of 50 ounces or more when unloaded. Well, I guess that's, I don't know, what are they targeting, the 50 AE? Action Express? I don't know. Um, has a capacity except more than 10 rounds. 
a, a semiotic with a fixed magazine that has the capacity to accept more than 10 rounds. Wow, that's all your double stack pistols. Take those away. Semi shotgun, you know, they go telescoping, detachable stocks, and you know, all this kind of stuff, right? It's just forward grip. Um, anything with the, where the magazine isn't in the pistol grip um, is going to be an ass, you know, assault weapon. So directly targeted more or less at the AR and uh, the AK, you know, where your, your clip is not in the pistol grip. And so a lot of that stuff, and they go into a lot of this stuff. They define what you can and what you can't. And, you know, I was talking to a buddy of mine, and he, you know, I said, I'm really concerned about this. And he goes, well, I'm not. You know, we're grandfathered. It shouldn't be an issue. And then you go in this verbiage, and somewhere in here, I forget where it's at, but uh, they, they talk about grandfathering, and you can store it in your safe, you can use it at a certified gun range, um, but they, they don't talk transportation. They do talk about how you, if you have it, you can't carry it where it's um, like slung over your shoulder, you know. I, I, I could throw a name out there. I'm not going to, but slung over the shoulder and ready to use fairly quickly. Self-defense. Doesn't matter. If it's, a, if it, they, you know, can't go, can't have that. So, and they go into the sale and transfer stuff and all that. But uh, this is going to impact a lot more guns than you think. And I hope people just don't, I hope they read this. They being House of Representatives and Senate. And anybody else that is thinking about, they're going to make 100 million people uh, <laughs> criminals. And, uh, you know, it's like. It's going to be very... We've been through this before. This is unconstitutional. There's no doubt about it. Again, um, go back into... Um, I'm going to go right here. I'm going to cut away, and I'm going to go and give credit to where credit's due. This guy right here, Guns and Gadgets. Go to his channel, subscribe, like. He has links on his videos. Um, last two. There's one he put out today, early this morning, and then there's one that was put out um, last night and uh, watch both of those do your own research spread the word let them let the house representatives in your state senators let them know you're unhappy this is not cool this is not uh, they're making law abiding people criminals and I know they think they're doing good and that's the problem they're thinking and their thinking is wrong. That's the problem. It's, it doesn't matter the tool. Hopefully you found this information uh, valuable. Do get over to Guns and Gadgets. Subscribe. Throw your support behind. Uh, there's a, an organization that he's, he's uh, part of. And um, they're making some good strides. Um, not going to ruin it. He's got a new channel coming out too not related to guns go over there he's a good guy he'll keep me informed and much better than i will subscribe to him but i do he asked that all of us get the word out and get it out fast and with that let your representatives know that this is not a good thing let them know they won't be re-elected i know some of them won't be already but there is some rhinos out there that may be elect, you know still in the wind and we won't know for a little bit here, but uh, that's probably, I, I sense desperation out of the, the group, the group being the Democrats. They have the majority. They have some incidents that they really feel they need to act on. But let them know it's not the tool. The tool being the gun. They will find a different tool. I know they think they're doing the world a favor, um, but they're a few of these people um, that are causing these incidents are nothing compared to I don't want to put this I want to put it carefully um, them leading to confiscation and making good people bad people and that's what they're doing here and there's there's already enough turmoil in our country enough division 
we need to we need a different solution than getting rid of tools that's not the you know I could go on about all the cars and everything else out there right there's so many deaths from cars it's like we need to get rid of all the cars we need to get rid of them now it's unacceptable to have this many deaths from cars it's not the tool anyway take care stay positive and do let your representatives know and tell a friend <laughs>